want to know what it is uh, that makes a drag show family friendly. Because if you follow it to its logical conclusion, you can slap family friendly titles on anything. You can have family friendly gentlemen's clubs, family friendly strip shows, family friendly Fifty Shades of Grey read alouds. Will you appro approve my flyer if I want to host in all the sex secrets of the Kama Sutra for kids and families? If it's family friendly. It's my question. Wow. Uh, what is it about a grown man? And I honestly, sincerely, as a woman, mean this. What is it about a grown man costumed in a sparkly bra with augmented boobs busting out, a leather miniskirt barely covering his twerking ass with tuck tape on his front while spreading his fish netted legs as he writhes on the ground? Grinding his groin next to a minor, mm, family on. friendly. Right. You owe us an answer. Mm -hmm. no. And you know, you don't get to hide by just taking something down off Peachtree and calling it a day. You owe an explanation right. and an apology. Yeah. <laughs> a massive problem with child porn, with sex trafficking, you, a little school district board of adults, made the decision to feature an event to hyper-sexualize young children. Do you want to know that the word that defines that? It's groomer. You all played the activist pimp for an aligned surgical center and for a 21 plus gay bar. It makes you groomers and activist pimps and we won't have those sitting on a school board who oversees the education of our children. You all stepped out of line. You should be ashamed. Yeah. Yeah. There is nothing loving. No. There is nothing. Let's unite and include. Because the logical conclusion of that is you end up in diabolical evil. There are boundaries. And you don't slap family-friendly titles on stuff to cover your ass.